welcome back to another YouTube video. My name is Lauren, if you're new. I am in comfy clothes. I'm about to change because we're meeting some friends for brunch. The same friends that we met up with in my last vlog. I just, I ended off that vlog last night and I'm starting a new one. So that's what's going on. Um, I need to figure out an outfit. It's like weirdly cold. It's like 50 degrees outside Florida. So it's like weirdly cold, but yeah, so I need to figure out an outfit. And then right when I get back home, I'm putting on this comfy outfit again. <laughs> What? It has whipped cream and a and sprinkles on top. What'd you get? Ice, green tea, peppermint. I just got the sugar cookie almond milk latte, but I get half the amount of pumps, and I think that's the trick to not get it to taste so sugary. Okay, so. This is probably gonna be the last time I'm gonna talk about pillows, hopefully, fingers crossed. But if you've seen any of my previous videos, then you know, I've been going through it with pillows, like through it. And I took last weekend off of YouTube. I don't know if I mentioned this in a vlog, but I took last weekend off of YouTube filming. It was much needed. I'm gonna start doing that more because I literally don't take weekends off and it's a lot to be on seven days a week. Like I work Monday through Friday and then I'm like doing YouTube Saturday and Sunday and it can just take a toll on your overall energy and mental health and well-being and just everything. And I have literally vlogged every single weekend for as long as I can remember. So I just don't really take time off or time to myself. So I need to start doing that. But, and last weekend was nice, it was relaxing. But I mentioned uh, two vlogs ago, it's now going to be like three videos ago, um, I have been through three pillows since that vlog and I'm returning this one. I got another Casaluna King and this was a down alternative fill and it's like a cool touch pillow and I think it's meant for all sleep positions. Just. <laughs> does not work it's just I have done so much research on pillows it's insane so I think I've come to terms with what pillow I need so in if you guys don't care about this like skip through in Target there was a Casper pillow section so I started looking into Casper and I was like okay if this doesn't work I'm gonna look into Casper pillows most pillows that they sell in the stores are medium loft and that means like how high up they sit on the bed and since I have a small frame I can't do medium loft pillows because it pushes my head too far up and down so I need a low loft pillow so I didn't buy the Casper pillow from Target I bought it online and it just came in the mail and I kid you not I've been counting down the days until this pillow comes in and it just, it came in. It was sitting at the door when we got home and I'm so excited. I really hope that this is, this is it. This is the pillow <sighs> because my neck is in pain and my shoulders are in pain and I'm just tired of not sleeping well. So I got the original Casper pillow and I just want to say thank you to everyone who has I should have started off this vlog with it but thank you guys so much for all of your comments and suggestions and like well wishes on like the whole it sounds so stupid but the pillow thing i appreciate all of your guys's comments in regards to like what works for you guys what you've done what pillow you use what pillow i should look into Looks like this. it's a low loft original pillow i got the king low loft original pillow king size i don't know why i wasn't buying king size pillows but i just bought queen size pillows so i bought a new pillowcase as well i use the slip silk pillowcases so i just bought a new one let me take my phone out from underneath you so you can here 
Here she is. I'll obviously keep you guys updated if it works or not. Okay, I'm gonna try laying on it. I'll keep you guys updated. <laughs> I'll keep you guys updated if you care. I just got home from Target and then I went to Whole Foods and got some more almond milk. I'm gonna try out the vanilla almond milk. I haven't tried it. And we went to Sephora because it's right in the Whole Foods parking lot. And I got my favorite cleansing balm. I just am about out of the one that I have of this. And it's my favorite. It's $10. It's so good. Mm. So I got that stuff. And then I want to try, it's by no means healthy. That is, okay, good. But I saw, I forget this girl's name, but I'll put her name on the screen. I follow her. She does TikTok and Instagram. And she just made a cookie butter latte and she put this at the bottom and then brewed like shot of espresso over top of it. And she said it was so good. So I wanted to try it. It's not healthy. Don't even look at the ingredients, but... It'd be nice for every once in a while, a little treat. Okay, we're setting up our Christmas tree right now, which is exciting. We have this Christmas tree from last year. I think we got it from Home Depot. It's just a six and a half foot tree. It's pretty lit, simple. And then same ornaments from last year that we got from Target. Okay, here's the tree. This is where we decided on putting it because, I mean, there really is no other spot for it. Kind of thought about putting it over there. And that's perfect. Um, and shifting this over, but there's just not a lot of room right there. It would kind of block the door. This is really the only spot. There's a plug right behind it. So, okay, now we're gonna decorate it with some ornament. The tree is up. We just used a blanket for the tree skirt, which is what we did last year. It's just the easiest. And 
and then we put a bow at the top. I made this bow last year. I grew up with bows on top of trees and so did Christian, so just makes sense for me to have a bow at the top instead of a tree topper. So this is what our tree looks like. It looks just the same as last year if you've been around on my channel since then. But let me know in the comments down below if you're a bow family or a tree topper family because I'd love to know. I did a poll last year on Instagram and most people said that they were a tree topper family but I like to know if you're a bow family as well. So let me know in the comments down below. episode two about two weeks later after we started it okay I'm just making a smoothie I didn't vlog breakfast I actually forgot which is unlike me I did a little over half a cucumber and then mango half a lemon spinach and I'm gonna add some crushed ginger and then water. I wish I had coconut water, but I don't have any. Taking it easy today. I even am doing, I downloaded the Target app and I'm doing the Target drive up. So I ordered my groceries online. I'm going to pick them up. So I'm doing the whole pull up and they like bring my groceries to my car and load up the car for me and I'm just like so excited, it's so nice, it's the little things, I am so excited. the worst lighting but I just got to Target and I think it's gonna take a little bit longer than I thought a little update on the pillow situation it didn't work so I returned it I'm returning it but um, I ended up ordering the Casper foam pillow and hopefully that works I think it's gonna come in by the end of this week they're still doing a sale on their site so I wanted to kind of get the sale pillow and try it out so I just went ahead and ordered it before I returned the pillow that I have didn't want to waste any time either but yeah it just didn't work out it's a little bit too soft for me it didn't feel supportive but my best friend Taylor got the same pillow and it worked out for her she said that she loves it she got the exact same one right after I placed the order she got one too and loves it so I think it just depends on your preference so I need like a supportive pillow. So I got a foam one, low loft still, low loft, and we're gonna try it out. And hopefully this is the end of the whole pillow scenario, but I'm kinda sick of it. And I'm sure you guys are too. You're probably like, oh my God, shut up about the pillow. But yeah, so I'm kinda just sick of the whole pillow thing. We'll figure it out. We'll get to the bottom of it. We'll figure it out, guys. Anyways. Just wanted to update you guys. I don't know how long I'm gonna sit here and wait for the grocery stuff, but. I just got out of the shower. I'm gonna do a face mask. I was gonna take a bath and steam my face and do the whole line, but I just kinda wanna get to bed. So I'm just gonna quickly do a face mask while I put away 
some laundry. I'm doing the Blue Algae Algenist Vitamin C Dark Spot Correcting Peel Mask. I'm gonna do that while I put away some laundry that's in the dryer right now. I'll link this mask down below. I've only used it probably like five times, but 